is that time of the year that all the artists enjoy so much because this season brings so much color and so much beauty around that you don't need any imagination. You just go outside and you feel your inner artist with lots of colors, lots of shapes and uh, the ideas are just blowing your mind and you are just thinking to paint and to do things quickly. So in today's video I want to invite you to share some of the ideas what you can paint in watercolors of this beautiful season of autumn. But before we start, my name is Ala, I'm a sketch illustrator and watercolorist. And from 2020, I'm an art teacher too. In today's video, I propose to you different sketches that uh, I have done already with autumn theme. As well, here to mention that some of the works that I will represent are already available on my Patreon classes. So if you think that you would like to learn something new, feel free to join my Patreon. I will be really happy to see you over there. As already mentioned, the autumn is uh, that beautiful season that it is filled with rich and warm colors, making it perfect uh, it, uh, making it a perfect subject for watercolor paintings. Uh, here I will present you some ideas, some watercolor ideas that uh, can inspire you for your creativity. I decided to go from easier works to some more complex ones and as well from smaller size to bigger size. Uh, what uh, one of the ideas that you can do is to, let's, I have here the easiest ones. What you can do, you can create some illustrations with some details where you will recreate the autumn, for example, fall foliage, for example, capturing the vibrant colors of red, orange and yellow leaves on the trees, of the trees, like we see here, here, here and here. You can experiment with different techniques and to create different textures of the leaves. Usually I use wet and red technique for creating these beautiful transitions that you can see. Uh, what you can also paint, you can paint some animals, some autumn mushrooms, some harvest time of the day. Those are rainy days, so you can make something like this. You can paint the still life, autumn still life. Uh, the, the most interesting is that you can arrange a still life with different objects like you that you like, that will represent the autumn. Uh, like for example, fallen leaves, some pumpkins. So you can check yourself what it inspires you. For example, when it is about the rainy days, you can represent the rain on the, by the window. You can also paint some leaves, some books, some cups with tea or coffee. Then I decided to share with you some of the works, one of work I did with the coffee medium. So you can experiment not only doing with the watercolors, but you can also paint with coffee medium and to have these beautiful pumpkins. You can do some red that will represent the summer. You can paint uh, some uh, grapes. The grapes are uh, as well a part of summer and autumn vibes. For example, these two works you can find on my Patreon. So some of the works are not on my Patreon. The previous uh, ones are not, but these two are on my Patreon. Then you can represent some simple, easy urban sketching like I did here. It is about Amsterdam. I decided to paint it super quick. Then you can just paint some uh, mushrooms to represent the colors of this. So this work was done on the fall of um, last year for my patrons as well. You can create the forest vibe and to represent all the colors. You can create this uh, serene landscape featuring 
the forest leaves falling or peaceful autumn um, forest like it is uh, it and then we can draw a house that re recreate the warmth as well pay attention that i use earthy tones to convey this cozy feeling of fall then you can represent the sunlight that comes in the forest in the autumn forest rich as well in different colors the previous works can be found on my patreon these works are already uploaded and available for your attention as well this travel sketch is ready for um, my patreon already these other works are not on my patreon but uh, these are more uh, done uh, use um, for pleasure and as well for checking out the paper how it works different techniques for example here i wanted to represent the foggy moment of uh, the fall morning in uh, by the river and i used a lot of warm colors and i used the wet on wet technique here i also uh, choose this work but even though this work can be found um, can be painted at any time of the year not only in autumn and this work uh, what why i choose to do i really enjoyed the moment of this beautiful reddish sky uh, what i have noticed that in september or october time the sky is more colorful than the other on the others time time of the year for example in summer very only in sunset on sunrise you can see beautiful colors or after the rain but here in autumn time the sky is just playing so many colors that it is really beautiful to paint it in another uh, painting the forest uh, another beautiful reflections of the sun in the forest here i decided to share with you a beautiful uh, flat uh, still life uh, it is more difficult to paint uh, from a real still life this kind of work but if you have any picture or preference of different uh, still life like uh, taking some uh, pumpkins of different sizes and shapes that uh, that have still some additional colors you can use some nuts some honey that have similar color and that will complete the composition so i like the way that this composition is um, have a lot of different uh, details on the right side and here we feel it like free it is interesting that like the viewer eyes is catching catched up and gone in this way and my last work that i would like to present for autumn vibes it is this french cityscape uh the i like a lot i like a lot to paint this foliage and as well the sky is gray and make a, a, it creates a lot the autumn vibes what makes it even more interesting Dear friends, I hope you enjoyed watching all my sketches and some of those inspired you to paint something new in watercolors. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask me. I will be super happy to answer all of your questions. And as well, leave the comments below, subscribe to this channel, like this video and see you next time. Bye!